Yes, Lord. Jesus. First Kings chapter number 18 and verse number 43. First Kings 18. And said to his servant, Go up now, look toward the sea. And he went up and looked and said, There is nothing. And he said, Go again seven times. The principle of the scripture here is. Whenever a prophet prays regarding any issue, the eyes of those who are exposed to the prayer of the prophet must always be open to see. Because there is no way you go to prophet who is a child born in X. As I pray for you, whatever praying you are going to altar, you will always be able to Where there is sickness, you will see healing. That's the principle. Whenever a prophet is praying for the rain, those about thing in full like about beggar my feet, good in full years. And in other words, there is no way good on prophet who's or tandaza. Gung and second next a semen sack. The man was there, a beggile, a maf, good in full is or yes. The prophet said, What about now? He said, Nothing. What about now? The prophet said, Until seven times. The Bible says, On the seventh time, why born? What I see a cloud like a size of a hand of a man. And the prophet said, As I stand on this altar and I pray for you, you must look around because there is nothing in the regarding your situation. Today is the day. Manga beng tanda zeli healing ilanga logo tu ibone na muda. Manga beng tanda zela ugu tumia ngufulege ilanga logo tu ibone na muda. Ene angufuna ugu tumje lusata ngudi ni yala ukiva pa gu prayer of the prophet. Ninga gabona ngalento i tanda zela yo makonda na nempilo ya. Manga beng tanda zelu tabantu na ba kuba pumelele. Ameso akazo ibona leon pumelele nzo begi tanda zel. I will do the praying. Peggy Simosako, I will do the praying. As I pray, uh, somebody gonna change also Ibona and Pilonyako because I am upon Mount Camel and I'm praying after the order of Elijah. There is no way good thing and Pilonyako is on a lem full of Usatana Tangege in when Unga Kataluk Pera Unga Katali expectation for as long as I am praying. It shall happen in the name. Hey, Masha Braki Mohoso Taba. I receive. The principle is whenever a prophet is praying, oh, yes. whenever a change is happening, you know that my father is praying. Oh, yes. I cannot be on the mountain even as tomorrow comes. When I'm a logo born on a bony next, learn to Satan at you. born out here cool as I pray now. Oh, yes, who's a boy born? I pen. Learn that to Satan. I born a yin dao as I pray now. Oh, yes, I born you shift. Learn to Satan at a yen sing as I pray now. So you born a yen. Learn to a tangy figure as I pray. Yes, yes. Oh, yes, Shabraha. I pray for your eyes. I receive. May your eyes open. See, so that as I pray now, unga tuswe logo satana kumbagon. Oh yes. Utuswe lento zoleto umkulegeng sobengwe nsa majembe. Oh yes. That's what matters. Oh yes. So if you are the servant of Elijah, you are looking towards the sea, and the prophet is praying. Ulogo boni drought, uboni drought. Don't be discouraged. Oh yes. For as long as the prophet is praying. There is a cloud forming somewhere. In the midst of drought. Parati men of God. something here for mega business in Yam. Isenga Banga in Kulio Napati. Kunento a four mega. Q 
keep on praying. There is something forming. I, I, I don't know if I'm speaking to someone. Right now, even as I stand on this altar, something is forming in your marriage. Something is forming in your job life. I, I, I think, but don't undermine it. Because it does get over as this man, but the more you hang with them, I receive. May something form in your life. I receive. May there be a cloud forming in your business. I receive. May a cloud form in your finances. I receive. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, wafika kimi Wafika kimi Ngathola 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 Somebody say in the name of Jesus In the name of Jesus As the prophet prays now As the prophet prays now Open my eyes, oh God. Open, Open my, my eyes, oh God. To see a cloud forming. To see a cloud forming. Over a horizon. Over a horizon. Over my business. Over my business. Over my finances, over my finances, over every area of my life, over every area of my life. as the prophet prays, as the prophet prays. open my eyes, open my eyes, let me see a solution, let me see a solution forming in my life, forming in my life, open my eyes, open my eyes, let me see a breakthrough, let me see a breakthrough forming in my life, forming in my life. As I pray now, oh, yes. let something form in your life. In other words, the Lord is putting something together. You are not sinking deeper and deeper. But you are getting closer and closer to your solution. Closer and closer to your breakthrough. Closer and closer to your helpers. Just lift up your hands. Wafika. Wafika Tona, 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 Wafika, 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 Tona, 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 Wafika, Wafika kimi Wafika kimi Esh abrahatu Natolupi Natolupi na oru napala Father in the name of Jesus with everybody's hands lifted up over this place Let a cloud form over their business Let a cloud forms over their life with our hands lifted up, I pray, oh God, the drought is too much. Nothing is moving in their lives. Oh God, as we enter this new season of stewardship, I decree and I clear them. Their eyes have seen too much tears. Their eyes have seen too much sorrow. They have seen too much loss. They have seen too much embarrassment. But today, oh God, in the name that is above every name, let the eyes of your people see the dawning of a new season. In the name of Jesus, where they used to see losses, let there be gains. Where there was no profit, let there be profit. Where there was sickness, let them see healing. Where they were down, let them see the top. In the name of Jesus, where things were being scattered, let, us, let them see the gathering of things. Zabra Kamashi Adrekedi Shima Mipro Hotalamangra Brankalia Izo Ibrahevra Kimo Izo Ibran Talakadoria La Crito Shima Habra Kesto Ibrekan Telemenga Pranto Ialupra Afra Kio Shono Abra and Telekenia Hasso Zumu Prakapasho Secretia Alimo Prendia Aliko Oprotosia Sika Abra Kadoria 
Something is forming. Something is forming. A office in Lomunela. Something is forming. Umaya way collector. We are cancelling. Something is falling in the form of a deal, in the form of a job offer, in the form of a contract for somebody. Yeah. Something is forming in terms of job opening. Something is forming in terms of salary increase. Something is forming. Masha Prakabosha. Ah, Jesus. I worship you, Lord. Worship you, Jesus. Wafika, wafika kini, mashi prokoshia. Somebody say thank you, Jesus. It is done in Jesus' name. Haritsama ya rirapela modi mo warisheba haritsama ya rirapela modi mo modi 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 samaya rapa Now, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Let's do the word of offering quickly. Uh, the book of Deuteronomy, chapter number 26, and the book of James 4 and 4. I'm so speechless. Thank you so much. Um, young kid, messages that I receive from some of you. I'm so blessed and privileged to pastor. GCC and um, I love you so much pray for you yes so Deuteronomy 26 starting from verse number 4 Deuteronomy 26 starting from verse number 4 and the priest shall take okay Let's do from verse number two, son. Start from verse number two. I think it's about clear. That thou shalt take of the first of all the fruit of the earth, which thou shalt bring of thy land, that thy Lord, that the Lord thy God giveth thee, and shall put it in a basket, and shall go unto the place which the Lord thy God shall choose to place his name there. Verse three. And thou shalt go unto the priest. Go to, to who? The priest. You will go to the priest. That shall be in those days. And say unto him, I profess this day unto the Lord thy God. That I am come unto the country which the Lord swear unto our fathers to give us. And the priest shall take the basket out of thine hand. And set it down before the what? Before the what? Before the altar of the Lord thy God. Alright. Let's do James 4. James 4 and verse number 4. James 4, 4. Ye adulterers and adulteresses the adulteresses know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with God. Whosoever therefore will be a friend of the world is the enemy of God. Now, I want to draw a principle here. 
Number one, in the Bible, the scripture says, you will go to the land that the Lord has given you. Mau figa lapo, uso sebens, the land could mean your business, could mean your job, it could mean whatever it is, your source of income. The scripture says, you must remember that God gave you that land. God gave you that land. Other people don't have a land. God drove enemies and God gave it to you. The job, God gave it to you. The business, no matter how big, no matter how small, God gave it to you. The scripture says, as you are working, and then basic business, you keep any mal, you know, the Bible says, you will take that and put it in a basket. In this case, it's like first fruit. You put it in a basket. You take it to the house of the Lord. You meet the priest in the house of the Lord. The priest will take the offering out of your hand. Are you listening to what I'm saying? And then the priest will start blessing you. Who blesses you? The priest blesses you. Now listen to me. We are so careless when it comes to the issue of offering. That is why a lot of people are not blessed. Why? Not because they don't give. It's a rubbish. Issues of, of offerings as God as it a church member. A fellow church member cannot bless you when it comes to your offering. You did not hear what I'm saying. The Bible says the lesser is blessed of the greater. Who are you to bless us? Every week, finance team is not going to not going to be able to do it. not going to be able to do Hallelujah. No, no fellow church member is privileged by Jehovah to speak a blessing. If I'm not here, you collect the offering. They bring the offering over to me. I speak a blessing over the offering. The priest is entitled to that. Alright, I think be serious. So Alright. Before you cook is a bunch of cousins, you went. Why my bosses laying out with the kitchen, Miss Ellen Cookus? But Lalan Basalon, you cannot go to a church where the blessing of your offering is coming from Saluan. Um Saluan, a little, we are tight, and a little, we are tight, and a little, he is not even faithful himself. Net more about to say, Lapam, because who said, Siabonga, Baba. No one can bless your offering but the men of God on their altar. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Number 
Number two, the Bible says, Otanda iswe. The love of the world makes you to be an enemy of God. So in other words, whoever you are affiliating or associating yourself to, I don't want to play with you. Manga be both Sabela Majos, Utoli Maliaku, Agbusi Samajos, Uzen Konswen, Sifunum Nigel, Amajosi, Hens in the Sea, Nashinto Sagiti, Nashia in an initial session. I'll sign Kenya Majos, Amaj Bobusi Sang of Babo Sabela in Amajos, Malfig and Konswen. Whatever offering of Niggers or Majos, Fanegui Niggers or Bani. A minute you turn your back on your ancestors, you become the enemy of your ancestors and you become a friend of God. When you turn your back on God, you become the enemy of God and a friend to your ancestors. Now watch me. Faithfully so. Uzo loga Uno munto oti ya ni uche hova Wang chola ngpasa Wang kipe kwa 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 la unigeli La mato oso wa shile Sega isita saku Maunga nigeli ufulu Mnyango kutapu ya so trena Ma finances sikuwe Ani nga understand di basalona This is the biggest problem ye baza Si nikipe mato oso ini Si buye nzo ba hike bengula Unga kipo kwa shu mistule siti tu I call my son um, Usfiso Mashaba Isol The spirit of the Lord was bugging me with him He's a millionaire. I don't know what to call the name. He's a millionaire. When he came here, he was not a millionaire. And I called him. I said, Fiso, tell me, you are not bringing your offering. You are not coming to church. How do you think you, I raise you from nowhere. I expect you every month to make sure rent just to make sure that your father is secure. For three, four weeks, I get bonus on twin. So I spoke to him because I'm, I'm, I'm very strict. But I'm very strict. I said to him, look, if you are not depositing money in my account, if you are not depositing money in my account, I will ask you to call you. And then he was like, I'm sorry, Baba. Whatever. You remember I gave a prophetic word to him and I said he's going to hire 50 Workers and stuff. Yeah, Ben Funung Ben Kulban no moyeng imche guti. Uba bo among chelenga fifty workers. Buye chobex buye osaina init. Uang chelenga faras bako. Because I'm going for nela ngutu zo faras. For nela logo na logo. If you are home, ukonza my father is Prophet Kuzwa. Prophet Kuzwa pays rent here. If you are not here for four weeks and your man is not here, how can you call this your home? This is not your home. I need a rental building. I mean, rental money from, from you. And then he deposited some lousy amount in Kombungam. Look, who's fish on at So I'm going to give him another call. I need more money. To whom much is given, if you are truly my son, you are truly my daughter, I will demand something from you. Knowing, because I can see your future better than you can see your future. I know with him, raise from Gupping and Bega Gupi. Because he gave me something like 2.5. How can you be a millionaire? 2.5. So now, before Zagi Muti, my father, pray for me. You must be ready because you are going to commit to this ministry financially. You see, I'm happy to the next. I'm paying $27,000 here. Now listen to me. If you are an ancestral worshiper, stop because you will go down. You will go down. I don't know. Because less it about Sabela Sigmiwa, so he see Tagizo. And they will come after you with this on John Shimali from who? Angfunu Shalanan. 
lala ngamanu konzela unga tighti but ube faithful le matlozi. Manga be logo It's either matlozi or muche hof. Mana maut mina prophet no mo pumile matlozi commit to the Lord. Niangi zo pasalo because oyi ongumga ni gankulu kulu oyi sita says. No ancestors are so cruel. They will come after you, strike you with diseases and sicknesses. I don't. Baso ba pagle prayer lani yama ala le yabo minister mabas na bo pastor mo. Angi kolab uza urola long kele sond. Utrino chai iti difference yala pa angi choli gache he ni ni agupi gupi shona la pushona kon. But the problem is, if you are not faithful, ne mali ako guche hofa. You are not. You are, you are not a friend. God is not obligated to bless you. You are opening a door. And they will hunt you down. All right. Now listen to me. Because of the number in the church, when we pay our tithe, we just put it in the offering basket. And then I take it I, to the prayer mountain. But the Spirit of the Lord showed me the scripture. And I look at it, and the Lord said, from now on what? Everyone who pays tight, bring them to the altar. But in Kelugu, it's a sober salon. One moment, also keep it tight. No more keep it. No more people trouble the seat. None, none. You come to the altar, much. But now, I want to talk to those who pay tight. If you want to pay tight, if you keep a question, me like, we told a number from whom I'm full this. You're tight, Yako. If you don't do cash, you do maybe account or you transfer, you, you, you must also come, la, a number, Yako. Because what happens is I went to this course to do my diploma in theology and stuff. So I did it and then I came back. Now, the church used to be registered as an NPO. Ninglale? As an NPO, non-profit organization. So to the course, we were like a number of pastors. The professor from uh, who was lecturing us and taking us through the course from, from Gauteng someone. So he was looking at pastors, looking at pastors. And then I, I was showing pastors something on the, in terms of our website. It's not everyone who says Jesus in Obuyakula. They will come to Jesus because they see the order in Jesus. Our website is so amazing. It, it costs something like 3.5 and 800 a, a year to maintain the website. We paid that money. Our website is so beautiful. So the pastors were kind of like looking. So the professor took interest in our website. So he went to our website. He looked at the things that I'm doing. And he said to me, is this your, is this your church? And I was like, what in Uzalangomli? You are in Pumalanga and you are running this ministry. This ministry, you do power ministry, you do all these things. You are in trouble. How are your papers? Not I'm registered as a non-profit organization. What you know what? You are in trouble. Every NPO does not own nothing. They pick a list, they do a list. Mabanga is a man, a non-profit. Mangaba submit anything or should anything happen to this church, they are going to dissolve us and then buy tata young kid. If this was our building. As long as we are registered as an NPO, we don't own the building. Anytime we to go to Kelubambi meeting, like when I guess Pum, Umparatu Bambi meeting. And then the, the professor said, Man of God, I like you. You are so gifted, you are so anointed. So I'm going to register you. I'm going to change you from NPO, of course, a man, to Section 21 company. You're going to have your tax number, your tax exemption and then your certificate of registration. Now, the professor said, all right, even when you are registered as a Section 1 company, Section 21 company, still, you must bring your books, but at least everything on now is we own. So, Lailan Basal, next week, my papers are coming back. I have my certificate with me. I have my credential card with me. I can go to hospital anytime, even though it's not my thing. I can bear it. So my license is coming back as well. I'm not a fly by night man of God. Or I can produce my license and go there. So I can do whatever without being questioned. So I'm going to take my sons as well and my daughters with those things. But Lailan Basalwan. They said to me, every tithe as a Section 21 company, 
we record a number. We have that on our database. Every time so you tell if I get bank, it record a number. We say my pen on yaga. We are told about that one. Submit my paper. We put naga alone with young man. Say that up because they say to me, if we put all the money in the building, that's what scared them. I said twenty-seven thousand. They said twenty-seven by twelve. That's over three hundred and something thousand. You are close to half a million per annum. Where where is that money coming from? One was a professor at Namikel Wukbus, who is at a player mark. What's here again? What came? Let me tell you something. There is a woman in Pretoria, Chobek, somewhere. Who are renting a building at 25,000. There were five members of Patale 25,000. He's offering Yaka every Sunday, maybe about 1,200. When two of those members were pulled out, that woman could not run church. She was attending Namush. The professor said to me, Man of God, for how long have you been in this business? I said, I'm running two years, but we've been somewhere paying huge amount of money. The professor said to me, You are so anointed. You are a true man of God. So the professor, my wife was there when I was graduating. The professor said to me, Next month, I want you to bring power minister where I am in Gauteng, in my church. So I'll be going there. So now the man of God said, how do you collect money? I'm not a crook like that. And the professor said, really? I said, yeah, what? No, you are a man of God. Because a lot of men of God, they cannot handle the 10,000 rent. For the past two years, you are paying 27,000. You deserve your own place. And I said, we're working on that. So papers are coming back next week with our tax exemption. You can take our certificates to any doctor lab. I'm not doctors, they are heavily taxed. Doctors are heavily taxed because of our operation about Wednesday and American aid. If Uber Niggas our tax exemption certificate, but Fagi Maligit, at least Baba ne tax relief from a SARS. So on Funabuti Java Stalu Akast, the month of stewardship, one kumuntu fanega kitchen mashone lenale. You will go to doctors, you will go to whoever. Where the bag nigga two thousand is fine. Five thousand is fine, ten thousand is fine. We need that money. We have a target of two hundred thousand in five years, and I believe good the way sing a corner we can make double of that money. So GCC is not a flight by night. Doctors will take their certificate to their lawyers, lawyers will confirm with these people they are honestly registered, and then we'll take the money, put it in our account. See, Tolinda, we're going to People in Gauteng are surprised to see what we are doing here. So now. Listen to me, Barcelona. As the professor was addressing pastors as, as Fundisa, he said something very important. He said to pastors, Pastors, why is it that your God does not deliver? And then he looked at me and said, For the God, except for the God of Prophet Kuswai, because in Bunile, we are delivered. What pastors, why are going to deliver? You know, I woke out of that, I was so humble. I was like, Sometimes, Nyangwatis. But compared to what I see out there, and about the Baboni Grace Essinayola, my partner would see that the church sends a game gimmicks. Slow was for number five thousand and upper, Mama ten thousand. Right, since I was a low grace in Mali, but as Nigeli, Nalion Telale, Malfagi ten round way far, but the God of Begela who sends a good Sisali Silla. So, I tell about someone this. So, if if a professor who barely knows me, you know, Guno President Masego. Wala, a, 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 I think he will minister like he said, extension four, who serves as a professor, such as Marian Salama, niggas, I'm a graduation certificate and stuff. And then one booth, what I, I saw something about Prophet Kuzwayo and the power and the grace of the Lord upon his life. What can you tell me about him? What a lawyer, what a lot of white and upside down, what bang in traffic, that man is a man of God. I'm telling you, for me, the other pastors, by and again, even a manager and school is not nani. I will find your traffic when you are next. When I was there, Beguba now nechem peg ya makar because the man of God is in town. So on for me, the other three pastors before tea in a basi legle building. I got to buy two alis. Now yeah, show my it here. Because the man of fire is in the building. Now, na pante go muti. That's all. Grace and prayer are equal. In it. Now, Lalan Basalwan, the man of God said to me, Man of God, look at the healings, demonstration of power on our YouTube and everything. He said, Look at this. I will tell you, next, I went to the 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 next, I
he said to me, Jenga lo still go wheelchair. Me na go be begging mo. And then he tell tell you, I'm running with that starting from today. What me na go be begging mo? Utanda zela band. Mabate tu pila me suti baso niga malin. Uya zala. Before me tanda zela, me chela yulangi mani kala me suti abu ya me tanda zela. Mati me na ya. Basalan. Man and Tola Nicola, and again, he's a man. Thank you, man of God. Thank you. So he let gone. Lala Basala, Manka to Munta does it and Pila, near Buyala. So Manga Kaliman, it lose Naga Tandasela. At least I will have been next Nayam. See, I'm too much for some of you, Majin. So is the Hambaranja, Majumutum, so I'm trailer with okay. Ufunuksu Agle will check. Marati Ebong is okay. For Nelly Sobos, I call my ex Wakona, a young kid to Bache with the prophet to Fudimal, Baxam. Basalon, I'm telling you. Gube Bonkela Matbes Bapilisa Babuyala, Nabesta Lila, Sipatale Labani Rentis Patale Lumunto Suele Wakula, Bamshane Bandele, Coronation Wesanalula, says Miller Tandazelayan. I feel this is a simple list that that devil is a bastard. I got such a lot of money to buy the jewelry that you call an art with simple list that my kids are wearing ham. Nibuye ngi nte la manchi niyambo. Nizong so la basalwan. Mauti hai seka tayo ni apuma pum akalinga. Ni ti puma puma manchi tati peki manchi. Hamba manchi. Hands up before I'm going to meet you. Hamba, man. You get away from the 27,000 of rental in your life. Accommodating parasites. People who are coming to take and leave. You get away from the house. You know, I was in my house. So my kate was giving me a problem. This motor thing. So, umamongeta yo umenga apa ufunungen. So I'm trying to fix something on the on the battery thing there. Oguti ke itil fuleg. So, omunyo mamo yan zula la. Utilo mama. How good you are in fazaban. Utlo ngon. Utlo sobe rekala. Utlo eh. Utlo maraban ya naksin leche na. Ni ni seli la. Load ut. So no. Lo ngata ka fund yugo tilo ukulima uti mara ba fan na la ba ba hamina uti lo ushonga uti anseng busa chie uti bancha uti lo aya ni choli gasias ni la ni diabola anzo tatis kasa mlang funu zovuti zaga la So, uko kusule kukulu, mawalo kat, hmm, hmm, hmm. Ngabonu ta, maka fike pasi na shayi isi yote ya, lo satane bekala. Angkona. But, la lelan basalwa, what we are doing here is serious business. Ning la lel. Now, we're dealing with stuff that doctors failed on. We're dealing with a whole lot of things. So, now, I'm starting something because in front of Kali Lento Yama business seminars Yaga Yama Isanda for Ozem. Once a month, I need every business person, apart from this presentation, that's often this one called. Nibiza, the spiritual side of business. The spiritual what? Side of business. Depending on the size of your business, you are going to register your name in the finance team. Oguti. I want the prophet of God to help me with the spiritual side. What is the spiritual side? The demons in the bedroom. Niangis? Kanya chamo kama bedroom manje. Nte demons we? Bedroom. No bedroom. No bedroom. Sisa minangos. Bedroom. Demons in the bedroom. Boardroom. Lalan basalwan. Ungangena ku boardroom. Bakete wen. Bati present. 
you know exactly what you talk about. Mafia lap, overwhelming any tongue I ask. Mount Genungen and Sinisia Mongas and Kenanas. Nangis Yazo to Nenzo Munti Hestai, Marapuma, La Wonkumutayan, because the Banjo is at Lazak. That's the spiritual side. It's a business. So you are going to register and tell me exactly what you are doing. And then I will tell you how much you are going to pay to come so that I handle the spiritual side of your business. Maubon with the Omalari Padalunga Begum Kondo Akona. Namani even a two year band. Nyangis of Basalon. I'm serious about businesses. And then we are going to start this one. Yara Mr. Semboe, everyone is welcome since I'm a presentation, since I'm a young But as for prayer, every month I want to pray for a band. You pay for, say, for instance, Ababa Mukosla, they are dealing about driving school. Uzo Patala, 4,000 for Ungen. Leo Nyanga Leo. Marabe Aufuni, Unga Nevenia Konga Ibon. Mazik Drapa, I will cover you for a way soon. Not for my problem. So, Tilanga Ungales was cut. Nyangis of Asalon. Why must we have business people in church who are not going anywhere? You are the most hard worker. Bapeti meet about Bakafula la Pamwako and Okafuli next. Mongela Pabak Drapa, Mont Babuim Gabizolo, Batataye. So I'm going to do those things. So for now, every business person I have by your policy camera, I will tell you how much to pay to come to my spiritual side of business. We handle the spiritual side. I will tell you what is disturbing in the spirit realm so that you can do your business free. You can have all your paperwork if you don't understand how to flow in the spirit, you are in trouble. So now, if you are not a tight payer, you are not a giver in the house of the Lord. And because I'm not a giver, Mangabe lo kwezi kwenza lagi akshula buye lagi yo. Ange gube ne mala, ange gube promote. Buye lagi yo. My name is Prophet Mantla Kozo. I approve of this message. So now, wangu muntu, also keep it tight. If you are deciding now, you don't have cash. Uzo buye la, uye la pemu ufa ubache le ngitaita so much. I need every time to come to the altar. I need to bank everything. Be professional, man. And as far as we see, make say easy to I expect everyone as we start the month of stewardship. Put your back. Put your weight on this thing. Support us. Sibon with sense The office is open. I'm paying people. I'm doing. As a matter of fact, the church must be able to carry every expense of this church. I'm pulling a plug from Bafana keyboard. Man, Ababoni, Nazgu Tang Sabapatal. The church must pay them. Niangis Wabasala. Listen to me. No one can have a department license on Twitter. I'm going to do what you call requisition form. I was a very good lima, Lapago, Mamumo, Yobesabak Niges. You fill in a requisition form. Ubachelas Funimali is a seven to twenty so and so. Go sign away. Who was among me seeing what Sam was a good Timale so Ipumea Yabang Funu, Ungen and King. Because if the professors are able to if you pass them, they will be able to share. But if you to share, they will be able to share. They will be able to share. But if you to share, they will be able to share. But if you want to share, they will be able to share. But if you want to share, they will be able to share. In one day, they raised 300,000. In South they calculated 300,000 times 12. They will be able to times 18. Is it 18 percent? What is it? It takes, but for all these years, we it in Malika. What is your Amelia in Kizi? Niamas Kawan? Yes, Long Tala or on one assassin. What is your Amelia in Kizi? Why are you professor? Professor of Lum Lung said. So I don't want that problem because Bangchali, we are on YouTube. If people on YouTube, Babona Lentoli, they will send spies with Bazo Salala. As we collect money, but begin the next thing they shut down the church. I'm in jail. So we need order. Every money issue must be recorded. It must go to the bank. I need the books to be balanced. In petty cash, you know, everything for us, everything young kid to record. We are professional like that because people were shocked. How can you command so much power, so much crowd? If you are going to help us and pay tight, we are going to record you. But then, we are going to keep all the records. But because of the 
and then what December our fail. Imagine if you keep us at a low yard, if you keep say Peggy and she would oh, can lose them below how you know by a kid. Oh, Taita, how okay. So, Basalan, let us be up to date. Then understand the Basalan. So, now I know we are many, but if you have your tide, so. We come to the altar, we bring that to the altar. As a priest, as the prophet of God, I'm going to release a blessing upon your life. Lent your glory, you are violating the altar of Jehovah. What do you mean? But I must speak a blessing over that. They will keep it for me. I must speak a blessing. You know, the professor used a, a, an example. For instance, Basalan, a sitting pete. Ntela ubano peti mala. Ntela no mai malin. Ntela tri yaban tu nigen different manis. Nzonbo isela beka ngitati. My wallet is sixteen. Yes. Thank you. Okay, Basala. I get see a nigel on Your figure, Mr. Cook, we ponsa. Pastor Jerry, we ponsa. Uzianda, we ponsa. And then whoever we are ponsa. Eh, Mina, say yes, honey. Pete, 200. Naming Funug Nigel. Niabasa Bantabanchan, Funkoma something. Professor says very something, something important. And Basa Bantaban Sachal. All right. Now wait. Sengi Afrika mina is the man of God. Nufunu kulumis busis. Ima liya la baba itu. Ise seko nala. Man kulumis busis so baya busis ek. Why can't you tell that? Sese takes in labu tu zolo gutata ma change. So basalan. Umuntu angatati maliaku. Because in time to change, and listen to me, matter to tata yaku. Aksi kutu itage tile fele beka klinde lapo. What if I tata pume na aye na yo samo? Nye bonda le ntole. Ifu funuk nigela nigela. Mwa funuk nigela unga nigela. No banda. Mwa funuk nigela unga nigela. So be careful kutu abantu benta nye mali yaku. So we don't do that. We are looking for example, my offering basket of new keep, of new change, of new ways. My own people know this. We look drive takes apply. I'm both drive takes. We so change the band to legally and official. We are change the line going away. We are talking about that. So that's how it works. So we so tell them to manage. We so keep a rental offering, and then lava banye bama tight seat and whatever. Every Sunday, I need all of you to come to the altar. So that as a priest, I speak a blessing over your life. So that's how things are going to happen. I'm changing our membership form. I'm going to put on the back of the form indemnity. There are things that are going to We are going to have an administrator also fund this about my doctor i mean my principles while i'm concerned my values what our statement of values what we believe in before signing membership form who's committed who's ball pay what it mean a so 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 see i understand that for me i got to go to my side so but again everyone who signed membership for my consular Consider yourself not a member of any church. Unga show nigle figi unga signanga the new membership form. Wanga sing to abe nati so no agasi member because lama old membership form they are being abolished. Our sasebens. Niangton. So sasebens aga chal basalwan. Manje ya se change so I'm changing. We need to hire more full time people and staff. So so tell us man be mali to year rent. Now lalan man kuli mangi rent. I said to you, as you give rental money, rental offering in this church, you connecting to property. 
your own personal property. Good Lord, your men of God who is doing your work are at Oshwanga because in Kipi rental. Nami, I was going to get it. Niangi so basalon. I was going to Osha brakama na yasata. Na noma upumi le laurenti ako ni tazen met, but God cannot forsake you. I give it. So now we are doing that. But mama, between 18 and 17 uh, August, ni nengonzo yeni ama i women's conference. Please make it to be big, make it to be awesome. Nense chase into sense. So probably I can join you gangane and just release a, a, a blessing upon you. Manketa ngo ngi 18. Mbone with bana bang eko po bana bang. Okay, basalu, we are starting a new season of stewardship. Wonko muta ka yebe steward ala sevens. September, I'm excited. We are starting the month of glory. So all sorts of things are going to happen. You know, when we do that, it rains and everything, but our God will see us through. So now, tell us one be to you, Mnigel. Wa figa, wa figa ki, na tolu pila, wa figa, wa figa, wa Give it life. Wafi ga gimi wafi. Wafi ga wafi ga gimi. Matolupila. Matolupila oku. Para nyabonga. Somebody say in the name of Jesus. Oh God, as I give now. All right, man about patangi cash. Please go and swipe your your rental money lapa at the bag, and then Sibol go to send son. Mankatu Shimaela, 
The reason why I'm separating these offerings, shelter, property. That's what I want to pray for. Wafika. The Lord must see you through. The Lord must see you through. Somebody say in the name of Jesus. Oh God, as I give now, I'm taking care of your building, which is your work. Remember me, oh God. In my own property, in my own shelter, I cannot be homeless. My children cannot be homeless. For I am keeping the house of the Lord going in the name of Jesus. If I give shelter to the work of the Lord, oh God. Give shelter. Give shelter to my own family. In the name of Jesus. Spirit of renting as I give now be broken out of my life. I connect myself to title deed in the spirit realm. Ownership in the spirit realm. I believe I receive power to build my own home buy my own home my bond shall be approved in the name of Jesus I will not struggle with rental for my home for my office for my business oh God every time I'm going through a struggle in my own personal rental remember my offering and cover me in Jesus name let's do the wait Barcelona. let's do first Samuel chapter number one song is it's stewardship first Samuel chapter number one verse number 11 Matthew chapter number 25 starting from verse number 24 and then the last one is gonna be first Peter 4 and 10 in I pinned foot first Samuel 1 okay play soft for me so call it funda first Samuel 1 and verse number 11, and then made to 25, verse number 24, and then verse again, first Peter 4, and verse number 10. Are we there? First Samuel 1, and verse number 11, if we may arrange. And she vowed a vow, and she vowed a vow, and said, O Lord of hosts, if thou wilt indeed look on the affliction of thine handmaid and remember me, not forget thine handmaid, but will give unto thine handmaid a man child, then I will give him unto the Lord all the days of his life, and there shall no razor come upon his head. Alright, let's do now Matthew 25 and verse number 24. Matthew 25, 24. Just stay low, stay low. So can we see? Matthew 25, verse number 24. Then he which had received the one talent came and said, Lord, I knew thee that thou art at heart man, reaping where thou hast not sown and gathering where thou hast not strawed. Uh -huh. Quickly, quickly, please. Give me the next verse up to verse 29. And I was afraid and went and hid my talent in the earth. Lord, thou, thou hast that is thine. His Lord answered and said unto him, Thou wicked and slothful servant, thou knewest that I reap where I sowed not, and got away I have not strawed. Next verse quickly. Thou oughtest therefore to have put my money to the exchanges, and then at my coming I should have received mine own, own with usury. Alright, that reminds me. Take therefore the talent from him and give it unto him which had ten talents. Mm -hmm. The last one. For unto everyone, 
go back to the to the other one. Go back to 28. Take therefore the talent from him and give it unto him which had ten talents. That's bad. Verse 29. For unto everyone that had shall be given, and he shall and he shall have abundance, but from him that had not shall be taken away even that which he had. First Peter 4 and verse number 10. First Peter 4 and 10. And every man that had received the gift, even so, minister the same one to another as good what? Stewards of the manifold grace of God. As every man had received the gift, even so, minister the same one to another as one good steward of the manifold grace of God. We are starting our season of stewardship. This stewardship is going to be the work of a steward, the fruitfulness of the steward, and, and, and every other thing that comes with stewardship. Today, we're just taking it easy. I'm going to explain to you what stewardship is. Bume 225, in Bonnet, the name usury. Usury. Uh, it's more like surety. Surety. In this church, I'm no more going to do testimonials. Nyangton? Testimonials, you can be arrested. Because even Palelo Minister Kuku testimonial. Should something happen, something from Testimonial, especially if it's a legal document. So if you need a testimonial, you can go somewhere else. Why? We don't want them to come back to the church. But let me do it. Because when I went to the church, I was So no more testimonials. Testimonials. Whatever man we have in our account, whatever Where else can one get testimonial? Maybe from previous employment or whatever. So at least Basal Moyang Mapos is what before we told her Kwanan Nan Gunwan, but not in church because Sana Wenzel has a family stem Sebata, who figure those patting in the Jonshi Manzabantu, and then we are in trouble. So, no more that. Prayer, yes, we do pray. Prayer. All right. La braca bushes. The grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of the Lord abides forever. In Jesus' name, anoint me to preach. Also, anoint this that I had to hear it in the name of Jesus. Again, Kalegan. So, in case it's stewardship. Basalin, what is stewardship? Stewardship is when you are appointed as a manager of the belongings, possessions, inheritance, your money, muntu. So, pin the foot in it. Mabak hayarile, ugut guwe mube umtini mafa, no ma wempasa, your muntu tisa. Oye owna, you don't own that. For instance, I have this chair. The chair is mine. Niang chola basalwa. Basing appointa uba mungo sila u elder kosuti. Abe he steward. The stool acting a sack. Niang chon. Ye na ung pegele so na ung trinel so na uyas manager. For on on behalf of the owner, ugu se magabu ya the owner itoli stoolo se right. So, in the kingdom of God, none of us is owning anything. God is the ruler over all and God owns it all. Your life is not your own. The Bible says, don't you know that you are not of your own, but you are purchased by the blood. You have been redeemed. You have a redeemer, you have an owner. So, now God owns your life. He owns everything that comes with your life. Everything we pay is a gift to you. But the gift is not yours. That is why we have the gift of the Holy Spirit, not the gift of Kuzwai. He gave them talents. The talents were not theirs. God is the owner of the talents. Everything is in us. Somebody holla, I'm a steward. And if you are saying, God, you don't own the house. God own the house. God own the house. You are a manager on behalf of the owner. God give me a child. The child is not yours. They belong to God. That is why one day we are all going to stand and answer to God. Christians are not going to be to the judgment seat. 
in order to be judged for their sins. Their sins were taken away. We are going before the throne of God concerning their works. What are works? Not in seven years. But what the Lord is expecting us to do. He said, do business until I come. Occupy until I come. So if you have a business, it's not yours. It belongs to God. You have a church, it's not yours. It belongs to God. Everything on our axing a yak, it belongs to God. You know, a man of God says something very important. He said, uh, you know, sometimes Kuzwa, you stress yourself because the Bible says, for Christ loved the church and he laid down his life. He, Christ loved the what Barcelona? The church. He did not say for Kuzwa, I love the church. The church has a husband. So if I love the church, then I love somebody else's wife. So Jesus is the husband of the church. So because already your husband loves you. He said to me, you are a steward of, uh, you see now I'm too deep. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Abanya can take a bullet for you. When? You can take a bullet. Now three months, so cool me the case, send that WhatsApp. Babe, I'm going to tell you something. The way I feel you, the way I feel you, I can take a bullet for you. How? Masakbi is going to take a pill for me. Not a bullet, a what? A pill. Babe, I guess it's keep a girl part of the See, a 50-50. I'll start a bullet, man. He has a relationship I call Susanna. Na three months you can take a bullet. Na six months you can put a bullet in her. Uzo mina nzo kufayi kafu. How? When about her? Utando li. Oh, but hati bullet my so far yeni kafu. Kaza ni ntelen vali milo momo se se new relationship aga usha ele pa atis nge zonga wekseli. Uuu, pe we are phone na we are phone. Mwa warik se se nyange one, two, three. Yeah. I will four, five, six to get it. Walala on a spin, you are lying at a good night. Who's a major or conagula and a bang tanga good night? Me, you have a good young bachelor. Hallelujah. You know, I'm left with a couple of years before my head misfires. You have a mouse of your sixteen on your case, I say, see a misfire. So, Vamos for burning on the Sabanian. <laughs> they are misfire. I'm going to all that. I'm telling you, this off figure, man. In my early thirties, you know, I used to read a lot and read something, and then I came. I got to my mid mid thirties. I was reading the book of Genesis in Kawangu Tengfuna Goba Sefes. Time man. Why man just say Kuluma? Man, when Tengfuna Ephesians. Then we are born with a icon. So, my fear was 68 or on us. Now, but one of us is back by again. Okuluma was a shala lay. Emma Plus, the next seven, the one thing that I know, I'm going to say, I'm sure I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to Yinga ku satanas kathle laga gaki ahlalo hayi ukugile. Wena uthi ngabe kyakhalwa manje kyakhalwa sincuse sincuse labantwana bethe eh eh lalela take it easy bayeke nawo sese se Sunday school angithi bawo lobo sibhora in Matthew 1 and wena uyabona benza nge English Matthew 1 verse 21 in kilosi afika ku yathi uzozala umntwana umqambi igama lokuthi ngujesu eh laba bakhuluma naba ngizwa ngokunye abakhuluma so bayekele uzikugele nawe is fine hallelujah and abanye benu nakhula ngale sikhatha amakhresha ngekho khana ndidlala manje ngiyanibona abanye ngiyadlala la esontu ukhule sikhathi ngala amakhresha so Anyway, let's get into it, Basala. It's gonna be dope. Lalan Basala. There is nothing a CEO now. Everything we have, it belongs to God. Once you have money in your hand, you look at it and you're like, it's God's money. 
Father, teach me how to manage what belongs to you. You see, once that attitude is alagwe, and that's how you approach the things of God, God will trust you with more. You see, now, the problem with the church, we, the reason why we are slow in terms of accumulating resources and accumulating human resources or whatever it is, is because you don't ascribe it to God as the owner, but you think you are owning it. You don't understand what I'm saying. It's a carnal attitude. It's a carnal mindset. If that's how you do things, it's a carnal way. Let me start heating up and then listen to Paul. The Bible says, go and stand before Pharaoh and said, let my, say, let my people go. Whose people are these? God's people. Pharaoh says, they are my slave. Uh, you don't hear what I'm saying. So God is saying, they are mine. Israel is my firstborn son. Pharaoh looks at Israel and he says, Israel, you are my slave. So now, in other ways, this Pharaoh could not have a revelation that if God causes nations to submit themselves unto you, you don't own the nations. God owns the nations. Let me tell you something. Something happened just last week, you know, on Wall Street. Uh, Wall Street, it's a stock market in the U.S. Mark Zuckerberg. Bobana was Mark Zuckerberg, Mark Zuckerberg. Mark Zuckerberg. Bobana Bamazi. Nayazi Facebook. Buying Arabana Facebook. Yarabani Facebook. I call Namara Bazalon. Okay. Le Facebook on Ayara Mark Zuckerberg. A very young man. I think he's in his early thirties. Now watch me. Mark Zuckerberg and Facebook. Mark Zuckerberg is 73 billion rich. 73 billion US dollars rich. Now he's down to 60 billion. He lost 17 billion on stock market last week. Facebook as a company lost 100 billion because Facebook was worth just, uh, I think last month, 366 billion on stock market. One week, it cost 100 billion as a company. Mark Zuckerberg as an individual will lose 17 billion. He's down to 60 billion. Now, why am I telling you this, Bazanan? You see, my, 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 my problem is, the reason why I'm starting this business, spiritual side of business and stuff, listen to me, Bazanan. YouTube is from where? USA. Facebook, USA. Twitter, USA. All these platforms, what's the I call it from USA. We can say whatever we want to say, and all, most of all these people are Jews. You know, the Uber, the Uber, is from USA. And did you know what Uber does not own any car? It's just an app by Fagelab. And the, the Uber now, on the stock market, Wall, Wall Street, it worth 130 million US dollars. Since its inception, it was founded by two people. All of them drop out. But now, Mfrugul is something, Barcelona. You know, we, we're talking all this money and you're thinking of yourself and thinking of your company. What makes us to be slow in our wealth accumulation? Number one, the very building on Nayo or Ranagi business is not dedicated to the name of the Lord. Number two, yourself, your own life is not a dedicated property unto the Lord. You know, everything, listen to me. How do you master stewardship? It starts with dedication. The foundation of every successful stewardship is dedication. You cannot tell me what is suit yaki pilang unkulukul when you never dedicated it to the Lord. You dedicate everything to the name of the Lord Father. Lent wak singe yam nge yaku. Yika te wen. Um seven zeng utoli le nyau seven zapat. You own the job. Manage my job. Take the ten percent. You see the problem with us asina. That understanding and revelation, you're with a stewardship here to seven I have seen pastors going to the mountain to pray and pray and pray and pray and pray until Basabachoni you are looking for membership. Why? Because they don't understand you don't own the church. God owns the church. That is why Jesus died for the church that he owns. You dedicate it unto the Lord. You cannot tell me what he can do with the dedication. What is the dedication? What is the dedication? Understand the Barcelona. Now watch me. Ugo abanda ba ugo abanda kuti abantu ba sezwe ni magaka in utu muzwa kababa lo. Niyawas lo muzwa boba balo muzwa boko koba. When I ngowaku masegbu ikwele tenguaga chehov. 
Noma ngwa kuzwa. Mara mo ngena bo ngena kaku. Angzwa mi na uta zongo fena zongo shupa kichelem zinuam. Masek peta no accesse kaku. Ngewe yenzi plan. Lalan basalwan. Unkulunkulu will multiply and multiply resources upon us for as long as we have an understanding. We don't own nothing. So Pharaoh said, they are my slaves. And the Lord said, okay, Pharaoh, I'm going to kill you. You are going to lose everything. I'm going to drive you in the Red Sea because you are taking ownership over stewardship. Okay, you did not hear what I'm saying. Pharaoh, you are my steward. You are the steward of my people. But you decide to own them. So I'm going to drown you because I'm the sole owner of my people. That's why Paul said, who did I die for the church? Because I'm just a steward in the church of God. But God owns the church. And the more you approach life with that understanding, when your money is low, it's not your money, it's God's money. Who must make a plan? The owner of the money. I am a steward. I am managing. That's why because I don't own the house in the first place. God owns the house. Who am I to bring another man? Do you own the child? You are a steward. You are managing the life. God is looking for good stewards. Why is it that there are not many things coming our way? We don't have a revelation of stewardship. I want you to understand. Listen to me. If you have an office, I'm still at that level. Don't open that office without me, you know, having something that I can use as a point of contact. Now, no can figure in person, but I must speak a word into your office and dedicate your office to the name of the Lord. Now, understand the Lord. Now, watch me. Pharaoh was drowned because Pharaoh wanted to take ownership over the people of God when he was nothing but a steward. Understand me now because we are laying a foundation. In the book of 1 Samuel chapter number 1, we see a woman who has been barren for years, married but barren for years. The Bible says she got so desperate to a point where when she went into the house of the Lord, she began to pray. But when she was praying, she was, you see now, Rachel was an intercessor, a supplicator. But when Rachel was praying, she said to her husband, give me a child or lest I die. But then on the other hand, you have this woman, Hannah. Hannah is hitting a revelation of stewardship. Hannah is saying, Lord, I've been barren for too long. I never carried a child in my life and yet I have a womb. I pray that you give me a male child. But this is one thing that I'm going to do. As you give me that male child, I'm going to return the child unto you all the days of his life. He's not going to be my property, but he's going to be your property. So what was Hannah doing? Hannah was saying, when I get pregnant with a child, I'm not going to tell everybody that I own the child, but I'm going to tell everybody that I'm a steward. The child is not mine. The child belongs to God. When God hears the understanding of Hannah, the Bible says in that same year, Hannah got pregnant, and the following year, Hannah gave birth to a child. And the Bible says Hannah stayed with the child after winning the child. When Jehovah saw that, God, the Bible says God gave Hannah more sons and daughters. Why? Because God will never give more to somebody who insists that they are owning the small vehicle. Why must God add another vehicle when you are the owner? But as soon as you understand if it had not been for the owner of the vehicle making me a steward by his grace I wouldn't have the vehicle that I have now and therefore I give glory unto the Lord some of you you don't understand our prayers because when we pray we say Lord thank you for shoes and thank you for clothing and thank you for food and, and thank you for everything why I own nothing I am a steward the owner is Jehovah. If Jehovah does not give me anything, I'm going to be empty-handed. Now, understand the Barcelona. Now, you don't own nothing. But you don't own nothing. But you don't own nothing. Therefore, again, I know you do nothing. God will always add more to your life. But the problem is, we have not been taught in these things. We are insisting on ownership. And Unkulukul does not roll with owners, he rolls with stewards. Uh, I'm going to say it again. God does not roll with ownership, owners, he, own, he rolls with stewards. Abba Patifa, listen to Skacherhoff. So we don't own anything. 
So the Bible says, as soon as Hannah said, Lord, make me a steward. What you say over Tita, I hear you well. What are you going to do to prove that you want to be a steward? The son of some nigga, some nigga said, I beg you. And Jehovah was like, we can see what he is. What, okay? Get pregnant. I want to talk to somebody now. Who's going to say, Lord, I repent. I thought I own everything. I thought I even own my life. But now I understand I don't own nothing and I won't receive anything unless you give me. So I rededicate everything unto you, oh God. Show up as the owner. Show up as the ruler over everything. And Lord, I pray that you increase it. Are you listening to what I'm saying? I'm just laying a foundation in ownership, in stewardship. If the day I'm going to claim ownership over this church is the day God will stop touching your heart with his Isela. Listen to me. I need these business people to go and register. I'm so dangerous. Listen to me. Everybody who comes to church, I don't have a contract now. But I have a business on to it. I don't have a contract now. And yet you come to church. What causes you to come to church? It is the grace upon the man. Even if you have to take a taxi or hitchhike, come. Now, you see a daughter of mine, Mpume, I was dedicating her business. And she said something important. She said, Dad, I don't have enough money for marketing. But I pray. I said, the same grace that is upon my father, who is not on television, but masses are following him. May that grace come upon my life. Through the word of mouth, let my business grow. And I said, you have an understanding. What about you? You have all the resources. You can market your business. You can do all those things. But still, people are not showing up. Are you understanding what I'm saying? So if you team up with a man that, that the grace of the Lord depends work, who can cause masses to come and apparently with advertisement, what do you think is going to happen in your business? You understand, Abbasalwan? I don't own an anointing. Jehovah owns the anointing. I don't own power. Jehovah owns power. I don't own breakthrough. Jehovah owns breakthrough. I'm just a steward. Every time I see something happening, just like this daughter is going to start walking, I attribute that to Jehovah. I said, Lord, if it had not been for you, making me to be a steward of your power, of your miracles, signs and wonders, I wouldn't have achieved anything. So Lord, you can see, teach me how to be faithful over the little so that you can trust me with more and more and more and more anointing. If this is your understanding, get ready for another thing to be added in your life. The reason why things were not being added in your life is because you had an ownership mindset instead of a stewardship mindset. So today in Fungutu Zechisa from Gusitle Ownership, who's bigger, who's sitless, short, who in course, mina na imal, imaling a yak. Stewardship today in Kulman is stewardship. It's only tell about the work of the steward, it's only tell about dangers of not understanding stewardship, it's only tell how to be a fruitful steward. Nyang is over salon. We are going to see that the more lenyang it could be. Now, listen to me now. The Bible says. Jesus is giving a, a parable. That's going to be dope in a minute. Jesus says there was a master, the owner. The master delivered talents to three diverse men according to their ability and capacity. Some of you, you need to understand what you can handle and what you cannot handle. God will never give you a million rand. Your capacity is too small. Listen to me. The Bible says, the master delivered three talents to one man, two to another, and one talent to the last one. And the Bible says he left them behind. He went on his journey to a far country. The Bible says he stayed, it's going to be a all. Just, just follow me. Now, the Bible scholars, they tell us that a talent could be a gift. Number two, a talent could be money. Now, in this case, I'm not going to go with a gift. I'm going to go with money. Uh, you following what I'm saying? So he delivered, say, for instance, $3,000 uh, $2, and $1,000 to the other. The Bible says he went on his journey. He left them behind. Not even once did he say, you are owning this. He said, you are my managers. I'm giving this over to you. You are going to be stewards over this. It's not yours. He left them. He went into a far country. The Bible says the man, Abam has five talents, to whom five talents were delivered. The Bible says he worked so hard, he accumulated five more talents. Somebody say, Grace me, Lord, with the spirit of multiplication. 
Barcelona, I was going to into my fear something, so I could lose the veil. Nyang is outing tin. Ugo atenda no mutum tola kesa de matenda na utata no mukuba wak. Hallelujah. Ukesa give me the challenge, but a man kesa against a show with your case. Nyang is in case I want a langa pat in case. Daran. Ang funong kena ng kesa ganing. Eh? Jalo nga 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 Uti wa pega manza ti. Ay. Mkese. Hallelujah. Pat kona laba wese omunte inkrisi. Uswe no. Isolo ngi. Ene mina pelanga sha wengene pafina. Sangfamu ngene pafina. Nga ngene pafina ngisusa ko. Kesa every day, but me nang kesi ganing. Eh, lapo ning kolel. Ni kesa ga yowa ni shayi le ni alala ni kesa food. Hallelujah. One kesi gani ni akwata. Fano mangi Caroline? Kose ngobang se queen kose long kishi mara matongo. Baso te uti ni. Hallelujah. Basa ni akwa sukse lipkwen mungan. Hey, uzo kutu wa militi ane. Uba bone basu la ngeku. Funa. Mausu alabat aikona na yulendo tayako. Ujeven. Maeso uza mawuti. Mabagini wukuja na munga rasutu ya shia nyan to le force. And what's your celeb queen? She a yano, pussy choose Joey. She a just yeah, babon with the AI. I got figure over la. I'm Koyan, who told Muta, who's a yapoza, who's a yapoma. I know, Bazalon. My mom Koyan obey. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. Yeah, for no big And now my more Baba. to Maybe you know my sentence near Nana. A massipo, Mate Angaranan. Upon Mama Sala Loga Peg. Atimarama weapon one now. book of records or ufuna in no and they Hallelujah. <laughs> seven slipper. So seven slipper. All right, Lale Lan me now imagine that. Listen to me. The Bible says he delivered the talents and then he left. The Bible says the man who, who was given five accumulated five more. The man who was given two, two more. The man who was given one, buried the only one, Abam Negeyon. All right. Now understand as we well move. Before the master delivered the talents to this man, none of them had talents. Before the master delivered talents to this man, none of them had what? Talents. 
they were all on the same level, empty handed. But the master said, I choose you. I give you talents. The rest of the people were not privileged. But these three individuals were privileged by the master. You see, sometimes you need to take a minute and say, Lord, I may not be having five like my neighbor. But the very two on the gayon, I wouldn't have had it if it had not been for you. I know I am a one talent man. But if it had not been for you, I wouldn't even be known as a one talent man. Some of you, sometimes you become pompous and so arrogant. Just because you are a five talent man, you're thinking you are better than others. Let me tell you something. The same God who gave two to others is the same God who gave five to you. Uh, you see, if I were you, I would spend more time being less pompous and more time working and thanking the Lord that at least he has given me something. I know I'm not a five talent man, but at least I'm a two talent man. I may not be a two talent man, but I'm a one talent man. But thank God, because when he was giving to others, he did not pass me by. What are you? Somebody hello, I'm a steward. And the owner will give me more. Now watch this. Let's break it down. The Bible says after many days, after many days, the owner came back. When the owner came back, the scripture says, Mara figure what he, to the man of nigger five year talent. Show me the talents. The man gave out ten. Said, Oh, thou faithful servant. Enter your rest. The one of Amnigay to Abuya, thou faithful servant, enter your rest. I waffle a Louis one. The only one who has my excuse to call a busy electric. You must have shown me the talent. What can you do? Private Nianas. We have Muntana Shalwa as good as you can achieve Nian. I know that you are a hard master. You reap where you did not sow. So I was afraid. I took your talent, I hid it in the ground. And hiding it in the ground does not mean work of our talent. It means that he went with agriculture. Because Think of something. Hallelujah. Barcelona, that's not business. And say, Tetu Nama Pakistan. Cell phone, cell phone, cell phone, cell phone, cell phone, cell phone, cell phone. It can't happen like that. Okay, what you cut a la song is sitting down there once you cut to say, Em Lung was up, I am Lung was up. How sounds you cut a raban? I'm a Zola. 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 So we are bang. La Bosses of a Tina won't keep us in the way one won't keep us. Basalon, that's not diversification. You need diversity. Lomarins are low when I insalo. Lomarins are low when I insalo. But the problem out of Yam Sarabon with all the Makunaya term. Now, so I paraoka super game Piloniaco. Bawa testa I want, but yeah, Sasa Basabui, so loyal. Loyal Tala para when I'll park. Nyangis of Basalon. It can't be like that. Lomarins are low when I saw Lom, Lomarins are low when I think of something on my hands. We all drive here and devil. Bomabil hold Nanan. When Zuama orange. Wonku Munti corner to corner my orange. Basalona squads went on a chant. Be creative. Hallelujah. Munta ga tolu tengi text. Ayi ga gama text ne. Song ke text. Song ke text. Song ke text. Song ke text. Iza gama ten rand. Ten rand. Ten rand. Ten rand. Ba yi yi kwanta. Somebody hala mu creative. So the man took the talent. He hid it in the ground. Agriculture it was easy and cheaper. Probably had a piece of a land, but I'm not even gonna be creative about this money. Listen to me when God gives you money before, before ends are anything. Creativity, money respects creativity. 
Because I So in other words, the five talent men were investor each talent to different things, not to one thing. Because chances are Maglus one, a one is home. But by God's grace, gone keep right. You can break the talent down if you are one talent man. Half you get up, half you get up. Niyazu niyan pora na mushapati kondo ngi nchela yo. Niyangi swa basalwan. Don't invest everything in one man. O unyak sale na we. Mina vile ngi mnege gonke. You don't understand. He was my everything. 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 He was my everything. Mabang tatela yena vile ba tete gonke. So now, Lendota is your everything. So, the past when you go chocolate, a cheap. Nang ne stress, mang ne stress, ni chama chocolate. Eh? Ni chama PS. Au no ni imi kabi gwenza, ngenda ba yendota. I peche che, ngapa, u ne stress. Basalwan, nothing is your everything. God must be your everything. Niang is. No, you don't understand, don't understand. Anyway, I answer so. The master came back and said to this one, show me the talent. This man was like, uh, Master Ish. In fact, agriculture is keep on. The master was angry with him. Number one, the talent, if the talent belongs to the man, so the master into yak. So the proof that the master is angry with him is because the talent is not his. The talent belongs to the master. The master is angry with him. He says, take a talent from him. Give it to the one with ten talents. If we are not going to be good stewards, we are going to be good stewards. Because God cannot stand your fruitful fruitlessness. You are a bad steward. Uge what we manage somewhere with the motor report of Mchete no Munya Mamas or Fagis Panza. You see, Uskumba, Uskumba, the comedian, one wheelchair program I inside. Last year he gave out 4,000 wheelchairs. I ain't got a mabanda la anga temptuane no tease or school shoes go to Togiso Ibanta Lit. A man on his pants who needs a four thousand wheelchairs. Send Zanya Malucha of us, Nigayon. Are we stewards or are we consumers? No, it's my money. Besum Jerutus Kumbang, Arabes, a chief, Abegu radio, Abegupi, no education like Jay. His command of language is so poor and everything. But you watch the man on your TV screen. More patal TV license to patal TS, who patalel and I. We are getting a SAPC. Nes pants who Nigabanta Ma wheelchair. I said, Lord. Teach me to be a good steward. Which of what until you level, you are bound to bear so you are not a good steward. You are not a steward. You are not a good 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 steward. And yet, churches' doors are open from January to December. Send on my resources to Jehovah's CP1. But I'll answer your fears still, Pamwa Jehovah. In this very chapter, chapter number 25, there is a test of stewardship. He said, I was thirsty, you gave me water. I was in prison, you visited me. I was sick, you visited me. I was, I was, I was naked, you clothed me. He's not addressing about Zalon of Kuma Ilim. He's talking about Zalon, but understand the stewardship. Why must God give you a job? Whereas on your previous job, I told you, no one ran. The money was yours. But I was called receipt. Yet an hour late, the roller coaster. Oh, young tosser. Oh, but what are you doing? Hallelujah. Have I ever been here? Can you believe me? Who 
Everything we have does not belong to us. It belongs to the master. If you are saying, God, give me a job. For what? I want to dedicate it unto you. I'm nothing but a steward. Make any demand that you want to make on my job. I will meet the demand. Why? Because I don't own the job. God owns the job. Uh. And then he said to the man, on our one talent, tatani gui talent, that touched me. Can I spend a little bit of time on this one? Saul was a bad steward. King Saul was a bad steward. When the kingdom was taken away from Saul, he was never killed, but it was given to David. It's a principle of the scripture. When God sees a bad steward, what belongs to God in terms of the Holy Spirit and the authority of being a king, God strips you away and he gives it to somebody else. Because understand. Hallelujah. Hey, who taught you not to have? Who taught you not to have? Mark that we taught you to be funny. In the year was with Polish, a year was with Sega, a year starts to smile. Let's cut it away. We cap and clamp in Fugan Petit. And Zwano Munto Fuga, a fair sponsor. Mark and Zwano Munto, Onga Falumian, where Israel is a toilet. Mark you have a Ganumian or Nova, who sold a young kid to Yensayo, Isla Falanga, a toilet, Isla Falanga, Yumiano, Baba Yasmin and Zwani. No. I told him to to beg him to understand that. Yeah, Scotta looked at me like I was chatting to Tayako. You are a bad steward. Niangis, um, um, fast on Jano. Nigga, advice. Oche la banya bato advice. Abangu. Upi cross. Agafunu chelis. Ankala ni 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 be ni be. Mantila na ankala ni mcheli ndaba saki. Ushin to Tayako. Ni to tell him. Magalagi magatelelin chalun telelang obo yan bonani soft timi nang What sort of steward are you? Mama kyang pilu ya kinsu ya kire right? Hoi sulu ya tilis. Mama, it's unfair. It's what? It's unfair. Uwa kiwa we kaya unkulu kulu begegin. It's on your shoulders. That's why Sarah be a calling chelo Abraham go thang gene go hakar, but go hakar Abraham magawazu chelo Sarah go tiena sa fru gena go. Why? Because he kaya lima ngom. Ah, ningi iso ngi he kaya lima ngom. Indo ako mai kali krampi fane go bengu. I mean, eh, muntu fene chabi Aisha sa sa ngabi ni. Okay. Hallelujah. Listen to me. The scripture says, Saul, you are a bad steward. Bad steward. So tatum busong unigas with David. David was a good steward. David unified the kingdom. David made prayers for the kingdom. David fought wars for the kingdom. Whereas Saul, the first battle he ever fought, it was not fought by him, it was fought by his son, Jonathan. Yeah, now all he had to do was to speak a curse, go to Oswald and I'm to curse, not knowing that he was cursing his own son. Because his son was not present when the curse was spoken. Basalwan, what sort of steward are you? Guzo zonkis into Jehovah and Agnigeza son. Listen to me. We always spoke about we always spoke about King Hezekiah. Why did God edit 15 years in the life of King Hezekiah? He was a good steward. When he took over the kingdom, he dealt with high places. He took out false gods out of the temple of God. And the Bible says that they, they, he restored the feast of Israel. When he was sick and God sent a prophet to say, tell him he's going to die. He spoke to Jehovah and said, Baba, ukumbuli msebeze nyezi. Nitoli kuyaku yu mesi na leti ota. Ntola bantu bako ba hoshi pa ba yamu kuno kuno ngati work pen. Ntola ma fist na observe ngati fist must be observed. Awo wazu kumbulala. Ba inga ba nyebe nunga ba o face retrenchment ino mo face dismissal disciplinary hearing. Onga ya guche o fuji baba awo wazu guta talo msebenz. Because he rent ya se sonto ni zo safar. Umsebenz it tight is zo safar. Ba inga ba nunga guche lo. That is why you are running helter skelter, helter skelter. You are not a good steward. Somebody say, Lord, teach me to be a steward. Stewards 
Worship is important, Pastor Luan. Everything is now you're singing here in Omnegas. God owns it all. But in terms of what you are taught here, you talent to go in. Nigga is a loan at hell. The unfair thing, for as long as somebody is a good steward, they will keep on going higher and higher and higher. While you go down and down. Imagine you are in the same church. Someone is a good steward of everything which you offer, nigga. When you are a bad steward, that's the concentrate on the chapis. I won't too slow because now the chapis are here. I'm nigga, um, I'm pale, I'm texting. But the maga muya ma keep the chapis on. Since I'm not here, but in me, ma feel like um, 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 I'm pale, I'm texting. When was it we are coming? Come on, the chapis are bamu pale, nana. You know, being like bafun di sunfun. Amen. Bazalon, stewardship will cause God to trust you with more. Being a good steward will cause God to trust you with more. Now, in the book of 1 Peter, the Bible says, everyone who has been given a gift ministers to others as a good steward. You are the receiver of the gift, you minister to others with your gift. In other words, you acknowledge that the gift is not yours, it comes from God. And that is why it is called the gift is from God. You are a steward. God decides what he has given you should be added or not based on how good of a steward you are or how bad of a steward you are. See, I understand I the stewardship. I don't feel it's Sunday against Aganetod. Listen to me. In the book of Luke, chapter number 16, the Bible says there was a man who was a bad steward. This man was a financial accountant of the business. The Bible says he started cooking the books as a imani in the book of Luke. Read it from verse number four, five, six going down. The Bible says that the owner of the business was told to put it, your accountant is not doing a good job. The Bible says that when the owner challenged the accountant to show me the books, the Bible says the accountant said, oh, I'm in trouble because the books are not going to balance. But what the accountant did is that the Bible says, Why I will love a quelet I posyak. I'm getting ready to finish now. Marafia give what? How much are you owing my boss? The Bible says, What you want to 50 rand? What you want to 25 rand? 25 rand, he cancelled him. Why I want to quelet a malin 100 rand? What you want 50 rand? 50 rand, he cancelled him. The Bible says he did this because he was ashamed to beg and not strong enough to dig. When the master of the business heard what low ends they saw, the Bible says, He is a smart man. The Bible says he commended him for being a shrewd man. What? I'm no longer getting rid of you. You are going to stay in this business. Why? You are a good steward. You are able to when my relationship na my customers now because to every person I'm pulele I have here malibe kai kwele ti mal lo muntu lo uzo recommend more customers in other words the business is going to enjoy more customers than it did before because people as identified with the business as a generous business so when the master saw that he said oh, you you are no longer going to lose you you are a smart man in other words the man became a good steward for being a good steward. Listen to me. I believe good ne raise bam niggas. Ye male begai horn. Because the man demonstrated qualities of a good steward. Wabon good, I don't own the business, but I can be a good steward. Na yi pitel and wooting chabli sama custom. Walo muntulo and only business yak. And the Bible says he was promoted. But not only was he promoted, he was popular with everybody. I say this to your life. Be a good steward now. Understand I don't own nothing. And if you manage whatever yes, if I'm going to mismanage my money and mismanage my home and mismanage everything, God will never trust me with more. 
Lord, I want to please you so that you can trust me with more. Because if God does not trust you with more, but the more you please God and the more you become a good steward and you are trying even though sometimes you fail but your heart is there and you keep on trying because you are trying to business Go spoil your reputation, your owner of the business, and not you. Uncle Uncle, you just don't understand. Go back and tell a lesson to nine years ago. Only one year, one year, first year, one year, first year, one year, first. Man, that I've been causing people to branch. You check off your own check off your own shoulder. You should not manage one branch. You can't even love them. You can't even pray for them. You can't even cause them. You would buy a good right direction. I get caught in this way. I get caught polar. I get caught pillar. You find a new new branch. You go and see the branch. That's why most of the pastors, but when I'm a branch, go see Good Friday, but by a good headquarters, go fella two, you're about to branch in. Nagule, you go fella one. Nagule, you go fella three. Marutu, you're about branch all over. You are a waste of time. You are a bad steward. Baba, you keep it on the same thing. You're an applier. You're in CV. You're in CV. You're in late gang. I ain't got my malang all over 21. I mean, no cool. Why are you 40? And I know we are cool. Usalila masafana. Basalwan, are we working kingdom principles? If we are working kingdom kingdom principles, we must be sober. We don't own nothing. God owns it all. Nyangis? Chowo fakfana ya kistep. Joba majiste guleti ya nstalanga mahini sa talanga ani. When you are my pet, you are not so disturb. God must not disturb you. Get to do a research. God must not disturb you. If I know what I'm saying, I'm concentrate. That's why I'm not in a certificate. I guess some people might say, We thank them. We are not going to be able I have my sons and daughters now, Babu Caroline. Imoto say right. Or say right, Imoto. Sometimes by a high cow, so calls an amla. If you are long shine, cause they are two hours by a chick, Babu Caroline, my own eight. Babu Yele move and got the next place, Babu gets the next. He was in this step of work, what must not disturb you. But if you know what it says, I'm out pooping kilos in Zambia now. We don't get now again, my offices are serious. Funny kilos in Zambia now, said no chair for just one hour, Wapum. You must be a good steward. Pastor why isn't that God does not trust us with more? Jehovah has to say, "Lo a one talent man. I let his spin is a five talent man. As to see laziness, yeah, one talent man. I let the spirit of industrious, yes, is a five talent man." This is your church. About they, they look at my website. They say, yo, 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 yo. Hey, hey, hey. So humble. We are just saying humble. It takes a lot doing what I'm doing. Courage. Commitment. You dedicate yourself. You see, I'm doing one-on-one -on -one immediately after the service. People are leaving. So what? I have these visitors. There's a man of God. I must deliver. Now listen to me. When you do business out there, whatever it is that you are doing, remember you are a steward. You talk to the owner. Father, make sure I pay my rent. I don't own this thing. You own it. As my business stands, your kingdom stands. As my business stands, your house stands. This should be your life. You can be promoted from one position to another, one position to another, but you are a bad steward. Be a good steward. A man who can take instructions. If a man of God says this, you say, all right. I know this is from God. I'm going to do it. Pastor Luan, I see you getting better and better in the name of Jesus. Today I'm introducing stewardship. Gain. The earth is the Lord. The fullness thereof. The people therein. We don't own nothing. But Yom Kito Nyeera Jehovah. From Ebantuan and Beju. Bio Yom Kito has blessed us. In Nyeera Jehovah. Do you believe that as we start the month of August, God is going to increase you? 
Why? Because your understanding about stewardship is at another level. Which I don't own nothing, but God owns it all. What are you going to do? You, I'm talking to a five-talent man, two-talent man, one-talent woman. A star is leading on. But your capacity must produce. Because he's going to come back and say, what? Lalelan, if you fail in your stewardship, so David is coming for every soul here. You know, a man of God spoke something to me. He said, man of God, be sober while you are still popular, while you are still anointed. Because in the next 10 years or something, God will raise up another man in Woodbank. And you will not be popular by then. You are out of fashion. What you used to offer their company, you are out of fashion. Young lions are coming in your company. Everybody is talking about them. What are you doing now? Tatabantu for granted. You don't even return calls. You're thinking you are the man. You know how many offices people have to drive past with Bafegwe like your office? Jehovah say, I'm testing you. No, I will call up. I will call up. Some of you, Jehovah, will tell three, four Sundays you are not here. And yet you will receive. But the Lord has long said, you will receive. In the political world, people are doing everything because they know they have a four, five-year term. They are doing everything. If they are stealing, they are stealing. Whatever they have to do. It's an opportunity. It's a rare opportunity to be in a place like this where the word of God is falling. I'm giving my sons a chance to pray for people and all that. If you guys are going to fail, you take me for granted. God will bring others a double of what you are doing. You understand. This was a platform. Some of you, you'll never serve God the way you serve God in here. Go to some churches thinking you are eating. You think you're the man. Do the singing. These opportunities are very rare and they are not permanently here. That's the problem. You see, some of us, you're getting older by day, getting older by day, you're still playing games. You can be make up. God gives you a loving man, you turn them into a beast. You are not a good steward. Did you make her better? No. I gave you a good man. What did you do with the man? No, he pays his yaki at my talish on a pass, but I'm going to email it. Books are not on a bad trade record. I'm telling you. You are a steward. Maufunu to Jehovah increase the logo now. Respect God. Work hard. Nale two talent. Work hard. Nale ten. Lale land basalwa. Le five I told. Why seven zen? Le one I told. Why seven zen? Why fele when si wani? Wapi? The more you are a good steward, who says you sit on a razo seven zen? On a razo apply zen. Fele when you office in lakuti wa enough. Si a keeper la ungena HR kisas. Apata ngazi na apply no. Si kboni le wutu tembe genchano. Zo logo peti mopu ispi no ispi na wakala gala mopu lao. So ufara gile fa we mshinini. Ufara bonke ba fige la kuwe. You are a bad steward. Jofi ya bonu. Mange kufara la pange un represent. Because ngeli mopu ngeli la ngi mopu ishi le pasi chini. Usele office in Lomunya. Osvila pela yona ela pa batu yi. What what secretary ya gaban ban wale PA nisela 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 ngai lo asapumi aban makasta maisha lo ba kacheli mobla bukori lo petwe ngo mausho alapu ya pumi nisela nusu shayi koras wa figa gimi wa figa gimi ne pilonga pa boshi mobla pia pet chuat ni angi zoba sala maus seven sa seven maus zalu zali if you are in church be in church. Because at the end of the day, whether you are a five-talent five man, two-talent man, one-talent man, I sing a wakong wagache ho. Song that in. Ufunu tu ambuyos buza na muhle. Baba.
Could it be the reason why Minisi Tobengezam is tattooed as Nigwaban? I see what you are loyal. I put him to my bed. I believe this with all of my heart. Which if God put you together with a man of destiny, Agbon, you are crazy. Nkulukulu ya ifumeli divorce. I ifumeli separation. Just to save a letter, I beg you, Lord, to When people of prominence and influence and power, Bahabe Masondwe is not always with Satan. You are here to waste them, and God has given them so much. With my support, the kingdom, you don't have a structure. Who raise with my love, I was not to flourish happy man. No book written like nothing. What can you tell about your church? Nothing. Somebody say, Lord, help me. But there will be an increase in Zagit. Just by being a good steward. Be comfortable in the five talent. God will go around at Hatek Lababani. Abanga went to We are born. My words are faithful. Sometimes I pray for people in Muntabuyati, but near the triple their salary. It's not yours. It belongs to somebody else. But it's over disqualifying them. You are born good. You are a good woman. You are a good man for them. Now you are going to be a good man. Now you are going to be a good man. Now you are going to be a good man. It's law. It's not law. These are principles. These are principles. I know people are going to be a good man. Because Jehovah is on their case. Bad steward. Your time will pattern life. May Jehovah add on you. Somebody say, Lord, give me grace to be a good steward. If you gave me stuff before, and due to my mismanagement, I lost the stuff. I repent, oh God. Trust me again. With more stuff. Now I understand. I must be a good steward. In Jesus' name. Now, your story is things used to work out in my life. When I sell things, when I sold things, things were selling. When I spoke to people, people were just coming on board. But lately, it's not like that. Why? Mismanagement. Failure to understand that you are a steward. So Jehovah must restore you now. I pin that ten bega something. Instead of good hearted, nalo arat hearted, nalo arat hearted, nalo arat hearted, I pin that ten but Jehovah got something. I pin that ten but Jehovah got something. Si mengenya o, si bamba mnegelo we to a free will, and then wangu mutozo tighter. Mtela uhamu yosa pi tighter akoro enza ini magabo tighter le before jaya bomba shango isau nuzo mtela ni zela go alter mag penning konsa. For when I something, Wafiga Kimi Wafiga Wafiga Kimi Atolupi Atolupi Aogu Napa Niabo. In the name of Jesus, whatever I have lost due to mismanagement, mercy Lord, mercy Lord, mercy Lord, trust me again, 
trust me again with more breakthroughs, more finances, more open doors. I promise to be a good steward of the heirs of the inheritance of the kingdom of God in the name of Jesus. Listen to me. I want you to pray a prayer, whatever area of your life. Why? Because you don't own it. God owns it. Now, based on that understanding, find out what trusting more. What you call own it next? When you own a young kid, song ten be a more Jehovah. Abaya be no fruit. The moti what the moti what the moti what the moti. There are problems that you never used to have, but we like this somewhere, living a life like it's just yours. Abanyabene, when you are sick, you don't deserve healing. Because once you fuga from love, you are healed. Into Zenza, you say, among us. I'm not talking about being perfect and everything. But I'm talking about, good Lord, I have fallen here, but I know your house. And I know you, Jehovah. You are a steward. Some of you are two talents people here. Some of you are five talents people here. Some of you are one talents people here. I'm telling you, na no mong pera wenzen, but good na banya bantu. We are tatel wak nige swa banya bat because you are bad. We are tatel. Into be ne kamala ko sare na isek at sesenge ya. Iche ofu boni misingo ya ko na yonke le ntole wenzan masukedi. Nokfara zagab toli. Agab toli next. So ya ten. Ntela kutma isa zo nige. Talk to Jehovah. Baba, you disappointed the people. Oh, man, I've been calling out when I got in my stewardship. See the Jehovah. Boy, say the rubbish. Mount to Tandazala, and I speak a word over your life. Is it those of where the Kalin and Pilonia go so long at Jenga Sekalin? But when saying the people, I think me now with me telling a prophet who has last word. What's word? Abanye ben the seat of attendance. So yes, uk attend every Sunday. It's a seat. Niangi zomtit. When sabuti na wama angels ak attend them more. You don't play games with church attendance. So that is uk tell them more, sit more. It's a seat. That's why abanye ben tuwe na when si meeting ang na muntozai because wa when I attend in there I na seat. Na noma ezo ni ba itata rongo ti game tuwe ben uze number zong guwa but at least you saw we see the attendance. Seasons are missing you like this. It's a seed. Talk to the Lord now. Talk to the Lord before you give. Talk to the Lord. You don't have to shout. You don't have to scream. We are the in every science. We are the Jesus' name. Father, I pray for every son and every daughter of mine and every other visitor here. Whatever it is, Jehovah, of many sit out see three take because they were bad stewards, mismanagers. I pray in the name of Jesus. Let your mercy speak for them. Let your mercy cover them. In the name of Jesus, let your mercy cover them. Let your mercy speak for them. In companies, in homes, in marriages, it doesn't matter where. In every area of their life, mercy, Lord. Mercy, 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 mercy. Mercy, Lord. Ah, Mercy, Lord. Send angels of mercy. I call it our words mistake. I call it our backless, but mercy is your portion now. Don't beat yourself up. Recover. Be restored. Be a strong woman. Be a strong man. You still have your life ahead of you. Don't make the mistake break you. Don't allow imperfection break you. 
Receive mercy in the name of Jesus. Instead of one, you'll be having five. Instead of five, you'll be having fifteen. If you need understanding, if you need understanding, you put your own trust in God. Now listen to this. Let us pray to say to my son. Hey, wafika gimi wafika. So tell us in a long time. Wafika gimi matolo pila. Let's lift up our items. Father, your name is Jehovah. You can do what no man can do. Whatever item lifted up in this place, I pray in the name of Jehovah. The name of Yeshua Amashiach. Every oil, blood of Jesus, endorse it. Change it into the power of the anointing. Every water, blood of Jesus, endorse it. Change it into the power of holy water. Every grape juice, blood of Jesus, endorse it. Change it into the power. Of the blood of Jesus. Every bread, blood of Jesus, endorse it. Change it into the power of the body of Jesus. Wonkum Sabati, the blood of Jesus, endorse it. Change it into the power of Holy Crown. Every other document, photos, whatever it is in what, blood of Jesus, endorse them. 
break whatever needs to be broken out of the lives of those individuals. Whether on cell phones, it doesn't matter what it is. And every other thing lifted up in this place that I have not mentioned by name. Blood of Jesus endorse it. Let it be well. Holy Ghost fire come upon every item of promise. Hand of the Lord come upon every item of promise. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I give you praise and I thank you Lord. Somebody highlight it's done. Now I'm going to bless you after blessing you. Number one, you bring to the altar and then please make sure that we are a mover. You are your tight number. I need to see that. Number two, you must have a prayer that is strong. Number three, you must have a prayer that is strong. Number four, you must have a prayer that is strong. Number five, you must have a prayer that
We love you. Happy birthday, mommy and daddy. We love you. last year amen and I can say my life was in was not in order amen I was lacking there and there I needed a shepherd I needed someone who can lead me amen I remember one time visiting another church it was on the 31st of December. And the pastor was ministering there. He was talking about a place called there. He mentioned something and Ngaibamba Nami. He said, you cannot expect someone who's never been there to take you there. Amen. 
and learn to young Israel. Amen. I wanted to go somewhere far, but I couldn't because I was not led by someone who's never been there. And up until I came here to HGCC, I found a father who has been there. Amen. And from where I was, he lifted me up from a deep my lay, and he planted my feet on the king's highway. And that is the reason I sing and I shout for Jesus came down and he lifted me up. Daddy, amen. Excellent, Akuluma, and Tawati, a divine appointment. Amen. So I was invited to come at GCC by my brother, not knowing Uguti, I was having a divine appointment. God was setting a meeting for me and like Uguti, to move from the level that I was to a higher level. Amen. And when I came here, I met Uteidi. Without prophecy or, or anything, but I was able from this level ground to a higher level, I moved. Amen. So, all I'm saying is that we thank you, Daddy, for being here for us. We thank you for obeying God's voice. Amen. To come and minister to us, Daddy. Because indeed, you are setting new levels in our lives. And we thank you for being here for us. Mama, we thank you again for supporting you, Daddy, through everything. I don't know how difficult it is to start a ministry. But Amen. It's hard. It's hard. Amen. But they are always there. They are dedicated. So Bazalwane, we have to show them love. In Zima But they are here for us, praying for us. So daddy. Happy birthday, mommy. Happy birthday. Yabong. Amen. The ministers, Abu Mama, elders, Bubaba Nabu, the youth, Kamalga Chus. Amen. Mina, we can show him seven in Kutin Kulumas, O Manga Kuluma, O Manga Kuluma, but it was a Mutina Kulum in March. Noba, did you to say now Kuluma Kulu, yes, there's a Wutin? So I don't want to embarrass myself. Amen. Um sing about mama, the Kumela Mama, Mama Maga, Wava Fana by three, Kutazo, Asana no Sisan. So Kumela Bo Mama. Sing about mama. See figalana si depressed, stressed, uh some busy pay psychological uh hospitals. Sing al to Lucizo. Sfigelana. Because of stress. But Stenas figure Glendow, O Teddy, Nankela, Asi, Patina Corner, Guashinja Yonkinto. I think in Abanga Bonisa, the first time you figure about Bonisa, the song Naman Halil was born. Embarrassed that day because Nambuya is Pekela, a visitor. Besanga Besonk is Pekela, is Pezu, but I never got help. Until yes, I am going to. What they lose from the silly snabu mama goti. We have to be independent. This is mad. That's why it's catches me. Naga shumaya la numa kuluma. We are ati. We seven zapi. Bese so we are badisa. We are badisa. Bese ati. Tati si viako. We enda we neso because ufunu kipa. O kipa lento goti. If umu mama we one, you cannot do anything. Uzamu we ask from this. I goti. This is mad. This bo mama. That's why I'm so depressed. Amen. You can tell that I love you. Amen. And you can't tell that I love you. 
I remember Mr. Vista, Espegela. Nothing poor lady, I wonder if it is not a stone to pet. A bag of speckle is cool, and I guess it's essential. Sit on to pet. And I was like, Say, you have one car. I'm going to clan and I'll speckle and I can't come to work for nine. But Nasfiga out, it was full. It's a good one, east wind, south wind, west wind. Uveluti, east wind, Ugutu, seven Sagu, Dawene, right on and Damara, east wind, Dilana. South wind, Ugutu, Ilapo, Oxalayo. Dilanay, <laughs> 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 So, we <laughs> So, the ladies of the house, the GUDs, we have a born about Minister Cook, we have a born about sixty, but you can tell good to know because who they do instill this this lady part, who two man is tanned. I think we choose your stories to really a lot of my channel party. Ogunya Yeniti, Naum Zali, Uma Upega Bantuana, Nakveda Bantuana Bango, Lili Banja, now you should Madame Koswangi Pamatika Bantuan. So I think Abantu never figure about Varasha, Zivarash is there too. Wakazaze, you would see who is Katu loaded in Oba, Yazuveli, Katu is Katisim Yakun Baras, Wakazaze, and you are feeling embarrassed. Uzo food and Nami, you figure a hell at that side. Jonah singing up. So, Uncle Zoxiza and just follow. As a funda, Umama, Umama, we are Panaka cool. Umama, take care of Abanta Batala, Umama, Bapan, Mina Uputuam, Wayapan, and Rapuzil, Agupe on Kin, to Bessex and Rafiga, at Funuko, a lepro, who is an angel, Sephora so land of Lomu to Simtel, which lepro who pay a mistake, you pay a while. But as if you did a lot, you know, Mamma Bapana, that was smooth to pack, let's have a special. So, see, if you did an artist, Nabo Mamma Guti, the more you give is the more you get. Ten, support, do everything. Always you could make it a cool, 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 so paramisa. So, Mamma noted the Santa Nakulu. See, look at see you go see back here, it's because of Nina. See, I was with Tandaza. And the other part, as the father fits in a mama. Spears car, look at the sun and I'm seven. But just figure out that wipe your tears, look at the Imagine this, Kalisa, I'm an angel, so I can't angels at the land at the last Kalisa. But in change, change, anything. I is Kalis, Kalisa, my angels, so I can. Now, what's like a part? So, happy birthday, daddy, happy birthday, mom. We really love you.
see youth send bomaga cool. So we wrote something, Lana, and I would like to read it for you. Uh, Daddy, when you walk into this room, the atmosphere changes. As when you walk into our lives, everything changed for the good. And it's not by might, nor by any power, but by the spirit of the Lord. Thank you for your obedience to our Lord. Thank you for the fear you have for the Lord. For that, he has strengthened your back to carry us. We are honored to be your sons and daughters. You are not just a great man, Daddy, but you are a great spiritual man. Every time you speak to us, you speak life. You speak the way and the truth of Christ Jesus. We appreciate every effort, every sweat, and sleepless nights you take to pray for us. And we also thank you for the support you give. Some of us wouldn't have made it without you. Some of us would, wouldn't, some of us are not dead because of you. Some of us are praising God because of you. Today we thank God for your existence because you are a great impact to the community. Indeed, you are the father to the God and the community church souls. Thank you for it all, Daddy. May our loving God give you more grace to do more of this. Happy birthday, Daddy. And there's our mother. Mommy, blessed is your womb. For you have given birth to a nation, and not just a nation, but a peculiar people, a chosen generation. Your soft touch has given us hope, love, joy, and peace. You're the best, Mama. A blessed woman amongst many. In the eyes of many, you're your prophet's wife. But to us, wow, you're a miracle. You know exactly what to do when we come running to you crying. You always have the right words to comfort us. Indeed, there's no bigger love than the love of a mother. You are a wife. A daughter, a mother, a sister, a mentor. And you play all your roles just fine. May, may God add more years, more strength, and more wisdom. Happy birthday, mommy.
quiet, guys. Amen. 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 Yeah. 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 I look at me now, I'm deeper. I look at me now, I'm a winner. Okay, so Namkanje, Yemozo by MC. 
Um, okay, so first order of the day. Amen. Please. Okay, as you know, it's on the letter. Um, we tackle both the physical and the spiritual needs. So, um, I'm a physical needs worker, whether it may be food or clothing that you need, it's in a helping hand ministry like Sondweni that you can visit after church. And then, um, for my physical, I mean, sorry, for my spiritual needs, we have Ubaba, Walaikaya, who takes care of that. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Okay, so um, my visitor, I hope after this, Okay, so it's cutting without receiving his, his healing. He knew when the angels came, but because of his excuses, he couldn't think beyond that he could get help. The spirit of excuses tempered with his mind. Uh, we're gonna do the prayer now. May we please all stand up when we're doing the prayer. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I refuse to stack in life because of the spirit of excuses. As I pray now, help me to renew my mind and think of ways out in every situation I'm trapped in. In Jesus' name, amen. I declare and take away the spirit of entertaining excuses from your life. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you. Praise and worship. From age to age, you still the same, oh Lord, we praise your name, we praise you, we Okay, um, yes. men of God. Yes. Okay, yes. Amen. Jo, lift up your hands. Jo, Today I want to deal with my sons and daughters. This is Varashi Zomaran. 
This side, I see an angels. I see angels. Zoko prekesha kete mukzoko ila damashia. Yes, yes. You daughter, you daughter, come, come. Yes, yes. Jo zaka prekesha kete. Jo prekes. Oh, shut it. Yes. Worshiping team. Tell me, God, give me strings. I can't hear myself. I can't hear myself. I need to focus. I need to focus. Yeah. So go break a shit. Take a boost. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, so. Oh yes, that's my father. What's wrong? What's wrong, daughter? Yes, daughter. What's your name? I'm Farah. Farah. Kids are going to I see Nels break. Yeah. Nels break. Oh, yes. Prophetic direction. Shh. I see Nels break. Nels break. And then I see Limpopo. Yeah, son of general, man of fire. Ah, prophetic Inunu. Yeah. Limpopo. No one in Limpopo. Antoike. Yeah, yeah, Antoike. This thing is from Limpopo. This is from Limpopo. Stand up, daughter. Yes. You have met the man of fire. My name is yeah. Master Kuswai. Oh, yes. My father, my father, son of general. Oh, yes. Lenta Tulo nyas tanda man. Lenta Tulo zise. Yes. Yes. Now watch. Now watch. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven. Power, take it out. Yes, yes. Stand up, Magasugumen. Magasugumen. Oh yes, oh yes, yes. oh yes. yes, yes. Hallelujah! Worship team, give me something. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yes. yes. Man of general, man of fire. Oh.
We'll go to a mountain prayer next week, but no more next week. So we'll cancel and take it to the other week. Yes. Thank you. so lucky to have a man of God like you in our midst, taking care of us, Ta- how many times he has prayed for us, how many times he has showed us where we went wrong, and how many times he has protected us and prevented wrong things from our lives, but he never complains. If we were in a situation, I don't think any of us would be as kind as him. Most of us would have been bitter, unruling, and <laughs> spiteful. So I'd like to, we have the knowledge enough to know that that's how a daddy acts. So the D stands for daring. He's daring enough to intervene and help us and prevent our shortcomings. A, advisor. He always has the best advice for our lives. D, destination orientated. Because he always cares about where you are headed, he makes sure you have a clear road. D, destroys, destroys all the weapons, the evil plans Satan has in our lives. And why is for young? Because even though he's getting older, he still makes sure to stay with the times. But behind every successful man, there's a woman. And that is very true in our case, because we have a wonderful, beautiful Amazing, God-fearing woman, also our mommy. We as the youth and Sunday school would not have made it to where we are without you, and we can't thank you enough. So we just want to say thank you and happy birthday, man of God, a.k.a. Daddy. May the good Lord bless you with peace, love, joy, and prosperity in your life. And we just want to say happy birthday, mommy. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear mom and daddy. Happy birthday to you. Good man. Happy birthday to you. I too engage for daddy and mama. So please cut a piece for yourself and a piece for yourself. Right? Yes, sir. In fact, Baba, you can cut it too for when I know mama and I'm cut it too for you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy
Nasia Bonga, a mamma. I know you've got something to say. Uba Bang with a pogoting in Kurumin Seganti, who prophetic direction of the Jack. Sagbonan Ninjani. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. It feels more like his. I can see all Bazalwane. Don't do miss. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Simbong Babungulungulu. Gugu Pelu Papa. I'm a bitch. Thank you, Bazalwane. Thank you so much. Siabonga on behalf of. Mina no Baba, yeah, Peluk Papa indeed. But in Jane, Fisa Joguti, thank you so much, youthy, thank you so much, Sunday School, thank you so much, Abazalwane Nonke, the love that you continue showing us. Yilo, Ellen Zuguti, Umuntu no Mangabe, Uzwa, Ukatala, you carry on because of the love and his kumbisa lona. So, sifisa nje uguti gakulu, siabonga, 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 as pezi from the bottom of our heart. Thank you so much. Uba bungulu nkula nenze njalo. And one promise, esi, 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 nige zayona. Uguti, we promise to grow younger every year. Hallelujah. Siabonga. I bless you in the name of Jesus. May Jehovah trust you with more talents. May the grace of the Lord come upon you and be a good steward. Oh, I remember that. Be a good steward in the name of Jesus. Be a good steward in the name of Jesus. Be a good steward in the name of Jesus. If God had trusted you with, you with one talent, may you receive two in the name of Jesus. If you had two, may you receive two more in the name of Jesus. If you have three, may you receive three more in the name of Jesus. If God had trusted you with a 4,000 salary, may, you, may he trust you with a 10,000 salary. In your business, may your turnover go higher. May it go higher. Your dividends increase. I bless you as a steward. I decree and declare. Whatever was taken away from you, receive it in the name of Jesus. I'm raising you up as a steward for the Lord. Steward for the Lord. God will intervene in your business because you are a kingdom investor. May you teach your kids to be good stewards. May you be a good steward yourself. In the mighty name.